Yes, sir. Record. Okay, Gene Williker. I know that's not your MC name, but I'm here with your father, obviously, and this is a message that should be sent to you as an artist. Now, your father said you are a hip-hop artist. That's a little different from a rap artist. If you're a rap artist, then you're more interested in your commercial success. You're trying to get a record deal. Uh, you're online. Your online social media game is right. All of that's rap. The commercial version of MC, E M C E E. That's the original term. We are MCs. Now, rap is something we do, but hip hop is something we live. And if you call yourself a hip-hop artist, you move away from the rap real quick, you'll get back to that later. But what you're focused on now is your community. Hip-hop is about community, culture, nation building. When you're an MC and you spit in the raw, as an MC, you spit it for your people. Rapper, you spit it for the corporation. Now, both are good. You're going to have to have a balance. But some people tend to lean more toward the rap to get the money than the culture to get the respect. The culture comes first because with respect comes the cash. With mastery of your skill comes the cash. When people like what you do, that's when the cash comes. Anything you master, you're going to get money for it. That's the issue. People do stuff, but they don't master it. They don't perfect it to the point that nobody else can do it like them. Once you reach that point of mastery, the money's chasing you. You ain't got to chase the money. Last point. When you're hip-hop, you don't have to go nowhere, okay? People think, I, I got to do this or be that or put this on or be this to be hip-hop or to get a deal. No. A quick story. 1985, I'm homeless in the Bronx for nothing, okay? It's before anything started. Really, 84, 85. I'm in the shelter. I'm thinking I got to look like LL Cool J, Kango, Gold J. I think I've got to look like Run DMC, Houdini, Fat Boys. These were the big groups in 1983, 84. These were the biggest groups. I said, I got to look like them to get a deal. I got to go to Columbia Records, RCA Records, Warner Brothers Records. I got to try to get in this place to get a deal. Now, when you are your culture, your culture comes to you. I'm in the shelter with nothing. In walks a social worker. I go see the social worker. Regular deal. I'm a homeless dude in the shelter. You got to go see the social worker. Go see the social worker. He said, what are you doing in here? What are you going to do with your life? So I gave him a sarcastic answer. Hey, man, I'm an MC. I'm waiting for him to tell me, get out of here and go get a job. He said, MC? He said, spit something right now. I'm in the office. I hit him in his head with the rawness. He was like, oh my God, I never heard nothing like that before. He said, yo, my name is DJ Scott LaRock. I DJ every Friday and Saturday at this local club. Would you like to come? Now, I, of course, I was blown away. I didn't know Scott LaRock. I knew nothing. But here's the DJ. I'm an MC. Speed the story up. A year later, we formed a group called Boogie Down Productions. DJ Scott LaRock, KRS-One. This is how it started. I was in the shelter with 700 homeless people, half of them crazy. Okay, other half out of jail, the other half crazy. Mm. We in there, I'm thinking I got to get out of here to get a deal. Uh-uh. When you are your culture, the deal comes to you. There's an old saying, the Christians used to say it, I don't hear them saying it no more. Be still and know that I am God. Right? Wow. This is the key right here. Judge. Be still <laughs> and know, just know. Know that I okay? am God. Okay, your culture going to come to you. And proof of it is that I'm talking to you right now. Dad's just hooking you up. I'm getting ready to leave. I'm packing my car. Dad run out. Say, yo, you got to talk to my son. This is hip-hop coming to you. You didn't have to go nowhere. This message is coming to you. So stay on your culture. Stay on your community. Only speak on behalf of the people. And the money going to follow that. Right? And that's, yeah. and that's the gospel, yeah. according to KRS-One. Of course. Peace and love to you, my brother. Oh, oh you getting hurt. You, you oh, recording everybody else oh, now. Oh, 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 oh,
brother. Peace Thank and you. love. You got yeah, it. Love. Go. There so we just go. so you get the other side of it. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. That's how I tell you, man.